hey what's up guys today i'll be showing you how you can make any windows pc or laptop faster in a few minutes let's get started first you want to disable all the necessary animations and shadows for that right click on my computer and go to properties then on the left side there's advanced system settings click on that and then go to performance settings to get this huge list of options here select the custom effects and looks to get rid of as many useless visual effects to make your pc as quick as possible and then jump to the advanced tab to change the amount of virtual memory so virtual memory is basically a part of the hard disk that the system uses as ram so you don't want to set it too high or else it'll actually slow down your pc so for this for the initial size set it to the recommended amount below and for the maximum amount use a figure that is double of that of the recommended size and then click on ok and reboot to get the first improvement on windows now for the next method open my pc right click on any drive go to the tools menu and then click on optimize drive so what we are going to do here is defragmentation now for those of you who don't know what this means here's a simple explanation so when you store data on your hard disk it's not stored in a particular order but randomly so it can be stored at the start middle or even at the end so the gaps that remain between them are called fragmentation so this slows down the computer when you want to access files on the laptop to get rid of this problem we defragment where all the files are kept in a correct order for faster access so simply select all your drives and click on optimize it'll take time but it's a good habit to carry out every month following that here's a tip to make your pc boot up faster right click on the taskbar and open task manager here go to the startup tab and disable all the apps that you don't need to start up at boot especially disable the ones that have a high or medium startup impact Another simple step is to change your power plan. For that right click on the battery icon at the bottom corner and then select power options. So if you are aiming for increasing performance then select the high performance power plan but just know that this will drain more battery life. You can change the plan settings like when the screen, hard disk and wifi are turned off automatically. You can also change the processor state and cooling policy. So this will help you achieve the optimum utilization of your hardware according to your needs. Moving on, go to system settings on Windows 10. Then go to the privacy tab and at the bottom of the list there is background apps. Here turn off all the apps that you don't use so that they won't be able to run in the background or be able to send you notifications. This will give you more memory to work with and it will also help conserve battery life so it's like a win-win. The final thing that you should be doing is cleaning up your drives every now and then. For that right click on the drive and then click on disk cleanup. Then here select Clean up system files to also get rid of old windows update packages, system memory dumps and other useless stuff. So this will give you a few extra gigs of storage and also a small boost to your PC.